We're here today at Reptile Tool Works with Sarah Burton and her beautiful buck she killed this morning. Um, Sarah is one of the original Apaka chicks, so uh, as soon as she said she had one down, she called us because we've got a new tool that we're extremely excited about, which is the new Hustler large game preparation tool also makes a great camp tool does some other work but she's here today with a hustler and with our standard camp knife and we're going to demonstrate a new feature on the hustler called belly zipper okay now oh hang on we did drag him out a minute ago using instant bowstring so don't forget this is the best way to get your carcass out of the uh, uh, out of the woods without damaging the antlers or anything the touch is very soft and then like i said once it's bloodied up you can just throw it away so sarah Congratulations on getting a great animal. Now we're going to go through some slower steps on field dressing, but the steps we want to show you will keep in, but we're going to do a little Julia Child here and cut it up just a little bit so you can. So we're going to get them in position to do the belly zipper to open the abdominal cavity. Then she's going to show you how this tool reaches way up into the cavity for the purposes of cutting out the heart and esophagus and removal of the lungs. Then we'll do the pelvic split with it and then show you how the front is used to take care of the sternum. Okay, so view along and we'll edit it properly. Thanks. Okay. Sarah has pulled the hide back from the area on the abdomen. Okay. And now she's opening up the knot to slit down here to get in through the cavity wall. Okay. And she's going to use the zipper, of course, to zip her right up through here. You notice she's turned the tool. She's picked up the cut, she's just under the skin, and now she's using the zipper feature to come right up through the carcass. May have to move the knife just a little bit, there you go. There you go, right on up, right on up. Okay, it's all right. back up a little bit all right look how clean that separates everything's in good shape we're gonna go ahead and push on up to the top a little bit and dump the cavity um, we'll be back with you in just a second to show how you use the long sharp end of that tool to reach up in the cavity and cut the heart and esophagus and lungs loose out at the end okay see you in just a second this shows using the curved side of the tool Okay, turn it over so they can see this. This shows using the front curve side of the tool here to open up through and chop through the sternum right there up to the center of that. With the curved portion of the tool missing the top of the stomach and everything, you can come in and very gently go ahead. You can chop that area out and forward with a lot of control for the purposes of opening up the chest cavity. Okay? With this curved portion of the blade, she can come in and split the pelvis and watch. It takes almost no pressure. Okay, this part shows, back up just here. This part shows you can reach all the way back up into the very top of this chest cavity with this tool. And if it's a really big deer, you can reach all the way up in here with this razor sharp edge to take care of cutting the esophagus and the heart loose. Okay, so you're going to grip back up on it a little bit there. Sarah's going to reach up in there on this deer and cut the heart and the esophagus loose. Then we're gonna dump the gut pile. As we finish up here, I just wanted to cover what Sarah has done. You've done a wonderful job, beautiful buck, ready to go to the table. We're gonna go in and take our bloody meat chunks, forks, and hunter harvest kit and have a little celebration right here on this beautiful Kentucky day and celebrate your, your, your wonderful hunt and celebrate your, uh, your, your true gift here. Um, once again, the hustler, is specifically designed, I mean, you can use it for camp work or work around the house, but it is specifically designed to do what it did right here, which is allow you to come in, use the belly zipper feature to open the cavity, okay? Use the curved blade here to chop up through the sternum into the heart and lung cavity. Use the curved portion down here to split the sternum, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, split the pelvis and take care of everything down here. Out of the cavity here, hang the deer and move forward. But a little bit later, when I get into fully processing this, I will show you how we literally cut through a joint with this part of the tool, how we can use it to separate the neck bones very gently. So with two very simple tools, I'm in a good position to work up this animal or prepare to 
tackle a much larger animal, uh, you know, an elk or a larger animal like this pretty much gives me an outstanding, nearly surgical tool to work inside a downed animal's cavity with. All right? Thanks. God bless you.